Let me try. Hey guys, welcome to Tina the Tuna TV. Tina the Tuna TV. Today, basically, we will be discussing about words that can help these first time travelers coming here in France. Yeah. <laughs> so. By the way, um, Anna speaks really fluent French because ever since she was like a baby, like even she was a Peter, she speaks French okay. already. Okay. So yeah, <laughs> much information. But we have a cheat here wherein I'm gonna discuss certain words and she's gonna discuss some words. So it's not like rocket science. These are really basic. Day to day. Day to day. Words. Exactly. Exacto. Not really that hard because when I said exacto. It, it sounded the same as in English, which is exactly. exactly. We'll start with how do you say good morning? There's two ways of saying good morning actually. There's formal and informal, which is just a informal greeting. Yeah, when it's uh, formal, mm -hmm. French people usually say bonjour. Informal, most people would say salut, which you can use in like different situations, but we'll definitely show you that. Yeah, we'll show it to you. And this is the video, one of the example. Yo. Yep. Bonjour. Bonjour, ça va? Oui, ça va? Salut. Salut, ça va? Oui, ça va, ça va? Now we're gonna show you guys how to say good evening, also in like a formal and informal way. So there are two ways to say it, like bonsoir. Yeah. And informal, it's the same thing as how you say hello or like in the evening you can say salut. It's really used yeah. everywhere. Everywhere, like all the times, like hey, what's up? Yeah, but. It since it's informal, you only use it normally to people that are close to you. Like friends or people who are the same age as you. Yeah. Like the same group. Yeah, it's kind of weird like you meet your professor and you're like, salut! No, yeah. not really, no, no, no. <laughs> you have to be formal when it comes to that. So yeah. here's another video that will show you how you can use it. What's up? What's up? Okay, and as for the third part of these learning French, basic French, <laughs> we're gonna teach you how to say yes, thank you, oui, merci, no, thank you, no, merci, mm -hmm. okay, oui, okay, okay, oui, <laughs> or you can say d'accord, yeah, d'accord is like, yeah, it is like, yeah, d'accord, okay, like. Okay, d'accord. And the last thing you can reply to those yes or no conversation is you're welcome. De rien. Mm -hmm. But you told me there's another way to say it. Ah, I'm sorry, je, my bad. I, my bad. Je t'en prie, which is. It's, it's quite This is why I was like hesitating because it's really something that we don't use that much, but mm. it's proper. Very French. proper. Yeah. Je t'en prie is like, uh, it's like I please you. Like, it's like. Very formal. Yeah. Another video that will show you. You know, we're actresses over here, so here it is. Anna? Is it good to on beer? Oui, merci. Oui. Oh, yeah. Anna, is it good to on beer? No, merci. D'accord. Okay, so what do you think about the video? Do you think we look good there? No, I think obviously I deserve an Oscar for my performance. Yeah, it's like no thank you, no messy. It's yeah. it's really, you know, it's so Emmy. I know, it's so <laughs> detailed, it's so hard. Okay, moving on. I would say the pronunciation for Asians, it's not that easy for us because mm. there's a lot of uh, you know, like, like the R, the R is like your and the oos and the oo. That's my main problem. The yeah. oos. Okay, but I might bum it. But I mean, <laughs> as long as you have the whole context, it's easier yeah. to express yourself. So we're gonna share now how to say excuse me or I don't know. Excuse me is excuse moi. Mm -hmm. But sometimes when you say excuse me, yeah. 
In can French, you can you say "excusez-moi," mm -hmm. but you can also say "désolé." Désolé, which yeah. is sorry. Yeah. Or it applies. Yeah, it applies both well. can be used. And there's another way to say it, which is "pardon." Yeah. Oui. Pardon. So normally, it's also an I'm sorry. I'm sorry and excuse me is both pardon. Yeah. Yeah, but in French it's pardon. Pardon. Mm -hmm. Oui. So. You got it there. Good. Thank you. Mm -hmm. And now the I don't know, you can say it in different ways, right? Mm -hmm. So one is je ne sais pas, mm -hmm. and the other one is je n'ai pas compris. Exactly. Yes. So. On point. So I'll put it down there so you know you can <laughs> learn it. So. so Check the next video! Check the next actors! <laughs> Vous aurez pas de cigarette s'il vous plaît. Vous aurez pas de cigarette s'il vous plaît. Okay, good actors. <laughs> By the way, another tip that we can share to you is we don't really pronounce the last letters here in France. So, for yeah. example, if it's S, like Nicolas, we say Nicolas. If it's Lucas, we say Luca. And then you might be thinking, then why in the first place you're gonna put that letter there if you're not gonna read it? I don't know, it's, it's French. Me, that's just how it is. It's just because it's French. And accept it. Yeah, and accept it. <laughs> so the next words that we're gonna share, these are really important, by the way. Usage of question forms. So for example, in English, we say four W's mm. and one H. When, where, who, what. And um, last is how. If you wanna say when, you can say. In French, we say quand. Quand. So, for example, a sentence would be like, uh, quand est-ce qu'on peut se voir? Mm -hmm. When can we meet? Mm -hmm. uh, for where? For where, you can say où. Mm -hmm. So, for example, your friend will say, oh, let's meet tonight. You can say où exactement. It's very easy. Yeah. You can say where exactly. Mm. Mm -hmm. For who? We would say qui. Qui. Six sentence would be who's gonna be there? Uh, qui sera là? Mm -hmm. So that's yeah. quite fast for them. Try qui, to. Qui sera là? Sera là. Sorry. Mm -hmm. My bad. And then the next word would be what, which is quoi? Which is say c'est quoi? C'est is it's or that. So mm -hmm. you can say it's what? C'est quoi? Or you can also say tu veux quoi? What do you want? What you, do you want? What do you want? Basically, yeah. you you really can't translate French to English like literally mm -hmm. because it has different meanings like the orders of words. Yeah. Just tu veux quoi is very very informal. It's also like mm. street. Do a what? Mm. <laughs> it's a like bit that. like slang, but like it's tu more of like, like what, do, what you do you want? Like why are you disturbing me? Exactly. Girls, this is a very good way to ask someone like, what the hell do you want from me? Mm -hmm. No way. You know what we're talking about. Yeah. So, yeah. so if somebody harassed you, you know, you can just say, tu veux quoi? Uh, okay. But yeah. And then, and run. Then, then, yeah. And then run. Jalal. <laughs> <laughs> For the last uh, word we're going to share is H, which is how. And in French, we say, como. Como uh, allez vous how, how are you doing? Very formal. Yeah. Comment ça va? Comment ça va? But it's very rare for French people to say comment ça va right now. Like mm -hmm. even with my professor when I asked him, can I say comment ça va? And he told me, ah, not really. Mm -hmm. You just say ça va. Well, I mean, I do use it, but only like if I haven't seen someone in a really long time, I'm mm -hmm. like, ah, comment ça va? Ça fait super longtemps. Really nah, 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 nah. Stuff. Yeah, if you miss your friends so much. There's another use for it actually, I completely forgot. It's like when, instead of saying pardon, like I didn't. Como? Yeah. Yeah, I you can say you. como. Like that's the proper way. Instead of saying what, what is like informal, but it's not a polite way of saying yes. it. My grandmother used to like destroy me if I used to say quoi. Mm -hmm. It's like, no, no, no. You say como. Like be como. respectful. Yeah. In English, of course, how, how, you don't really say that. Mm. But como is like if you misunderstood or you didn't hear the it word. It applies for what. But then usually when you put como in the full sentence, it becomes a how. Yes. It's really hard to have a conversation when you only know we oui and bonjour or like the greetings like yeah. the first time I got here I was like zero French and I'm like wee 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 and mm -mm. this is the kind of words that you really 
should know if you're even coming for a first time like take a little book write them down yeah it's really useful or otherwise you also have a lot of very good travel grammar books yes where basically they'll just give you the vocabulary that you need looking for a location Words. like where should i go should i go left should mm -hmm. i go right like that kind of stuff and that's really really useful useful that's and i didn't do that by the way <laughs> like i didn't do that i always use google and google sometimes kills you like, for people who read i think that's really useful but for me i'm not a reader myself <laughs> i hate reading but Dude. i like asking which is very annoying yes. no it's a very good thing to do do not hesitate to ask yeah. and do not hesitate to make mistakes even if you're not sure of yourself because right. if you don't try how will yeah. you improve and that's when you start to evolve in the language exactly it's like look i i evolve myself a little bit <laughs> So I hope you learned something today. Yeah, you guys learned. Was useful for everyone. Yeah, because I mean, you know, you don't want to be like Tina. Doesn't know what she's doing the first time she got here. But if any of you guys decide to come to Lyon and I'm still here, feel free. Yeah. I can show you around or give fifty dollars. Like I just no. fifty dollars per hour. No, mm -hmm. just okay. invite me for dinner. Buy me food. <laughs> I'm telling you, when she's <laughs> when she says food, it means food, like big food. No, so, no. no, I'm a, you know, like just buffet, that's it. <laughs> so anyway, um, and obviously thank you to everyone who participated yes. in the making of basic words for new travelers. For new travelers <laughs> here in France, okay. Mm -hmm. So I would like to say thank you to Chris, Lucas, and Mel, and you. And that's about it, I think. Chun! Chun! I'm sorry, Chun. We love you. Thank you, guys. If you want to learn more words or you have any questions, just comment down below. Yes. And we'll try to do more videos, And hopefully. respond to you, yeah. Yes, yes. So, like. Share. Subscribe. Subscribe. Tina the Tuna. <laughs> We're out.